here. So today, um, I'm going to um give you guys a little tutorial on how to download mods without using your WinRAR or Zip. All right. So the first thing you want to do is you want to open your web browser. In this case, I love Mozilla Firefox. I don't know about you guys. There's a lot of Google Chrome users out there, but anyways, um, so you're just gonna type in Sky Sky. That's S K Y D A Z Sky Daz dot com. Um, I'll leave a link in the description for that. But I mean, it's really easy to to just uh, go ahead and type in there. It's nothing too complicated to write. Um, so once you get here, um, this it, it'll look a bit formy, like the form, like the forms. Um, and so uh, there will be like mods, like um, for example, for example, uh, there there's mods here that show. Like this is the wasteland mod, the mob amputation mod, the Steve Carts, Steve Carts 2, whatever. So here you can see a bunch of like back tools and stuff like that. So, um, so uh, if you want to install a mod, you just click on one, or you could always search for a mod in this URL bar right here. So once you get there. Uh, there's going to be a, a brief description of the mod. So it says this mod adds a new aesthetic feature onto players, like its name. It shows some tools on the back of the player. These tools are based on the last equipped tool that the player had. This mod is made by iChun. All credits to the modder. Visit the original site here for all mod information. So um, you'll have like two or three videos right here so depending on what you use last so say you were fighting mobs with your diamond sword and then you switch to your pickaxe to keep mining well the diamond sword you just used would appear in, on your back like um, it appears right here so these are just like mod reviews for the mod for the current mod you're downloading so um so you can watch those and then it'll show you the install instructions and it and um when you're when you go ahead into downloads, um, I think this only wor works for Windows. I mean, I think for Mac it's download here dot zip. I'm not sure, but um, if you Mac users, you can go ahead and try it out. But um, yeah, so so if you're on Windows, and um, so you're just gonna click on DRCT after all these numbers and letters and stuff in in these parentheses. So you're just gonna click on DRCT, and then in your, your then you're just gonna download it, and then in your downloads here, um, if you're using Google Chrome, it will appear around here, and so you just click on your downloads, and uh, you just click on this thing, but currently it's like, yeah. So sometimes it does that, sometimes it says it's a dangerous uh, virus type of thing, but it's not. Trust me. And so then here you you choose what folder you want it to go in. But uh, here it says default mod profile forge. And if it says mod practice forge, then it's go uh, gonna um, automatically go there. So you can't really change that. But you can change forge numbers and stuff like that. But so just um, so then you just click on install. And then if it's if it's the very first time you um, install a mod in SkyDaz, then you do have to back up your Minecraft so the mods downloaded here won't conflict with um, other possible mods that you have downloaded in the past. So, but I have it all already done, downloaded tons of mods from this page, so I will just click no and it will start loading and then uh, it will. This will appear with the no with the name of your mod, and so back tools mod installed. So you just click accept, and you can uninstall the mod and reinstall the mod, and you can restore your Minecraft backup, and you can clear your mods, clear your config, you can open your Minecraft folder, you can reset this installer, and this profile, uh, this is the default mod profile that it's gonna download into. So. So once that's done, you can just close this up, and then you can 
you just go ahead and open Minecraft up, and I have a tons, 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 tons of mods um, downloaded. But um, so yeah. Um, anyways, uh, so uh, I have like sixteen. I had like sixteen mods, and once. It, once it's the first time, it will appear like four mods if it's a Forge mod because it, it because it downloads like Forge and and like um, Code Chicken Core and stuff like this, um, and a bunch of other stuff like this. So it can so you can um, so you can uh, manage the mods. So once you go on single player. And let's go just go into my redstone world, um, which I don't have much because I started it a, a bit uh, later, earlier today. But um, yeah, um, I was I was just uh, playing around with this. So uh, here it will appear more pages for your mods. If well, if you're using the too many items mod or not enough items mod. But anyway, so let me just. Uh, See, um, so say I use this, then I use this, then I just start to kind of like do that, then I switch over to my thing, then I have the last thing I used on my back, which is pretty, pretty awesome. So say if I use a Colt, this is a mod by the way, and then I use a bazooka, so say I'm using the bazooka, boom, 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 boom. Then I switch on to the, to the Colt. Then, um, then, but then I switch on to the Bazooka. Then the Colt will show up on my back. That's pretty, 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 pretty awesome. I would think that. I mean, it's, it's so awesome. I mean, yeah, so awesome. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, yeah. So. So then I switch on to the bazooka and the colt. And, well, basically, yeah. So this mod uh, is basically like a showing mod. What I mean by that is like a mod that doesn't like bring in new items or anything like that. But it's just a simple mod that um, that just basically uh, well adds like a little animation feature. And so, if you guys want me to do mod reviews on any mod you guys see out there in, the, in Sky Daz or in the forums, if you already know how to download it from the forums, um, and you're more comfortable using that, well, just tell me, and I'll try to find the mod in Sky Daz because I don't really do forums. I mean, I don't, I don't know how to download it from there, but um, so just tell me, and I will search for the mod, and I will do a mod review on that if you guys want me to do to do that. And so yeah, so basically that's all that I have to offer for today. And whoa, lots of creepers. And uh, I hope you enjoyed. So I will see you later. Bye.